Five, the boys of summer are back. Marlins pitchers and catchers reporting to Jupiter today. <laughs> CBS 4's Mike Cuneo has your first look at the upcoming start of the season. It's a little cold and a little rainy here in Jupiter, but that didn't stop Marlins pitchers and catchers reporting for their first day of work in spring training. We've heard a lot about this team saying they're in a rebuild mode, but if you ask guys like Don Mattingly, they're not exactly that patient. Rain, rain stayed all day. The Marlins' first day of pitchers and catchers moved indoors, but it certainly didn't damper any spirits. I mean, excited to get going, get started uh, with the two 2019 season, and uh, and we're hoping to get the power back on with the generator. Uh, <laughs> but uh, uh, looking forward to it. The team is loaded with youth, especially on the mound. But as Derek Jeter said earlier this week, they have zero patience and see the negative talk outside the ball club as a slap in the face. Like from the first day, we, we're trying to build this like winning culture. Like we're going for the whole thing. Like we're going to try to get a World Series. That's our mentality. Just coming every single day to work as hard as any other team. Guys like Sandy Alcantara, Jose Urania, and Dan Straley will likely anchor the rotation. But if you ask them, everyone's fighting for one of those five starting spots. You know, for us guys that have been around for a while, it's like there's there's guys coming behind us that want our jobs, and that's a good thing to have. You want that kind of internal competition, and so we have it now, and I think that's a really good thing. Of course, the guy directing traffic behind the plate is a newcomer. Jorge Alfaro replaces JT Riamuto. They call him the Lion, of course, for his full head of hair and athletic ability. But his greatest strength may be his ability to connect with his new teammates, making it a point to chat with each pitcher after every throwing session. I need to get to know them how they like to pitch, and I need to get to them and get to know them as a, as a person too, and how they feel after and before bullpen. So, uh, so that's what I'm trying to do, trying to be part of the team, part of the family. You'll see position players like Peter O'Brien officially reporting for spring training on Monday, their first game, February 23rd. In Jupiter, Mike Cuneo, CBS4 Sports.